to you. Welcome to Wednesday. Thank you, Mrs. H. Beautiful. They'd look good at a wedding in a church, wouldn't they? <laughs> I don't know if she does it. Right, a bit of um, joy in the room. So we're using one, two, three new products in this. Um, you might see from the title, Pearl. Um, very kindly sent this to me. I've got three of their razors now. Um, it comes in a box like this. This is the Pearl K2. And I'll show you what it comes. I'll just take the... It comes with the thank you for choosing us. Little note. So thank you for sending it. A little polishing cloth. Even a shaving guide, if you need it. And the main thing itself. Now what's unique about this razor is it comes with two handles. You can see there, that's how it comes. It comes with these blades, this head, and the two handles. And I'll show you the long handle. This one here, well I'll show you the two actually. Handy this, if you, if you like a short handle, that's seven and a half centimeters long, and that one's 10 centimeters long. The materials of these bl uh, blades, these handles are brass and metal, as it says. So I'm thinking it's brass, a brass handle coated with this uh, metal, is it like a, I don't know if it's a zinc alloy or something, and it says pearl on the handle there. Beautiful design, knurling, nice grip. That's what the end looks like. And it's a, it's a match on there, pearl, and the same design handle there. So we're gonna to use today the long handle. Um, I'll show you the head. So it's a two-piece head. The base plate looks chrome-plated. Like so. And this is the, this is zinc alloy. This is made of. So that's that. And then we'll screw it on just to show you. I'll put a bit of mineral oil on this. And that's how it looks together. Nice. So this is the Pearl K2. I'm going to go with, this will be the second use for the King C Gillette. That's what I'm going to go with. Help if I put it the right way. King C Gillette. Um, I'm not going to use the pack that came with it, because I like to keep that with, uh, with, the, with the razor, if you, if you know what I mean. But uh, what I will do, is if I can get another pack of them. That I'll show you the blades now, what it comes with. Fits nicely, there's no movement at all. So it looks like there. There's no overhang, as you can see, very, very safe. And blade exposure, that seems to be sitting quite nicely. Yeah, there you go. Job to see on camera sometimes. Um, these are the blades. The Gentleman Platinum, Super Platinum. Um, what does it say? Not to be sold loose. Made in India, so they're an Indian blade, yeah. So, uh, Max 7, Max 7 is called, Super Platinum Max 7, or Super Platinum Max, and there's seven blades maybe. <laughs> oh no, ten blades? So that is the name, Super Platinum Max 7. I've never heard of that before, or them, but we will try them one of these days. So, they've sent me the razor, a new soap. I love this design. Pearl Man, the Artisan Shaving Soap, Sunrise Bliss, 125 grams worth. And it's a, hard, it's a lovely scent. It's a hard soap. And uh, it states on their website, they, 
they sort of advise you to bloom it. So a few drops of water, hot water on the top, just before you lather. But in my case, it's got everything on there. In my case, I'm using the Captain's Choice um, soap blocker to give that a go. And I've bloomed it with a little bit of hot water um, in there. You see, I put it in between them three prongs there. See how it works? Um, because that's what this is meant for as a soap blocker. Gorgeous scent. Now, there's no scent notes on the website on the tin but if i could describe it it's it's a sort of a how can i put it very uplifting sense it's a type of scent when i smell it if you if you smell anything oh that's nice and it's like a cheer up sort of sense it's a very fresh um clean fresh and clean scent yeah very soapy fresh and clean scent that's the best way to describe it now this I think um, the Americans will like this one. Hey, 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 look at that. This is called the White Star Brush. It's a resin handle in the American flag. Beautiful. And it's got pearl at the bottom. It's a nice brush. And the knot is synthetic. And it's a 24 and a half millimetre. 24.5 millimetre synthetic knot. Beautiful, isn't it? Right. So we're going to... Well, I've loaded this now on the camera, but um, I don't know if you want to see a close-up of this. But uh, I'll tell you what, let's do it properly. We'll do a close-up as well. So bear with me. We'll load it up now. So there we are, there was a close-up, that's all done. Um, it's, it's a nicely balanced razor, so I'd say roughly around where my finger is, the balance point. Might be interesting to try this. Um, so now we'll create the lather. So there we go. Now, perfect. Now you might see my the water in the sink was a bit misty, and that's because I tipped the bloom water into my hand and put it on my face off camera because I forgot to show that. Um, and that's why a bit went into the sink, so the water's not clear. But that's lovely. And you can see most of the soap's gone from the middle there. So I'm going to start to create the lather and start shaving using the White Star synthetic brush, the pearl. Touch of water. Well, I've tried their soaps before, beautiful. 
There was one I think is like a chocolate, it reminded me of it, I think it's called coffee something. But uh, the scent is very sort of over here. If you know what the, um, when you go to a vending machine and get a cup of hot chocolate, that type of scent, lovely. Well, if you like chocolate. Really nice soap. You can add a good bit of water to this. Nice brush too, good bit of backbone to it. As I say, it's a 24 and a half millimeter knot. And we're using the, um, the Pearl K2 razor, three piece, non-adjustable. We're gonna heat it up. We're using the long handle, the 10 centimeter. As I say, it does come with a short handle, the 7.5, seven and a half. So here we go, first pass using the King C Gillette second use. Very slick soap. So I've just found now the angle for me is here. Wow, that is slick. They do good soaps. Tell you a bit how I feel with the razor in a minute. Well, firstly, it's cut through that first layer of whiskers there. Anyway, how are you doing? All right. How are your shaves or shave going this week? Hope you're doing well and well I hope your week's going well. The best of health to you. I'm using this, you see, good timing really because uh I know it's Thanksgiving on Thursday. Tomorrow, Thanksgiving in the States. I hope you have a fantastic day. Happy Thanksgiving to you in advance. This is a lovely, very nice razor. Wasn't sure how it would feel. I thought it would be a... Uh, um, a very very mild razor but it's, uh, it's mild but it's certainly you can feel the um we can hear it more and feel it cutting sort of precisely lines has a precise feel lovely slickness yeah i'll give them that they do good soaps right a bit more from the pack It's a soft brush, but it's got a good backbone. This is quite a hard soap. They bloom it, but as you can see, it's a uh, scent strength. Yeah, I'd say it's about about a three out of ten. Not a strong scent, but it's a lovely scent. As I say, I can only describe it. As it's a pick me up. It's a, it's, it's, when I scent, smell a soap like this, oh, that's nice, and it just cheers you up. That little, it's that type of scent. So I'd say it's a very soapy, clean, fresh scent. Here we go, across the, across the growth. That rate, that blade sits nicely in this. So it feels very tight. Hear that. Wow, do it almost um it's a funny feeling that hang on. It 
it almost sort of um there's like a suction to it if that makes sense sounds weird but not in a dangerous way it's, it sort of, sort of grips to the skin nicely and glides but it, you can feel it just Nice. Oh, I class that, as I say, as a mild razor, but not as mild as the Wilkinson Sword Classic, the black. This has a bit more feel to it, um, but it's a, it's a nice, well, you could hear it. It just sort of, no messing. So the old soap locker has worked well. Only just had this really a few weeks. And then um, the good thing with this, if you're a daily shaver, and say you create a lather like that and save waste in that, you could just put the lid on it. Tomorrow, come back, wet the brush, maybe a few drops of water and activate it again and you're good to go. Maybe add a bit more soap. Depends how you like it. it keeps any bugs or flies or whatever out here. Not that you'd have flies in your soap. You don't know, dear, they'll fly into anything. Or in, in my case, little paws interfering in into, into everything. Right. So, so far, so good. The grip is excellent. I like that design. Nice having the name in it too. That's a good idea, isn't it? So here we go. Against the growth. It's amazing sensation, it's like a... Excuse me. One thing I do know is their quality of service is good with Pearl because when they brought out the Pearl Flexi, the adjustable razor, they had a lot of problems getting it right. And I think they, in the end they brought out seven, I think it was uh, version seven of the razor because they wanted to get it spot on. And I think they achieved that in the end. As I say, with version seven, so they were very committed to, they wanted a good, you know, good quality razor that worked, that was right. But you gotta give them that. It's a very, very close feeling razor. Um, as I said, not aggressive, it's mild, but you can hear the blade, you can feel the blade. It's very smooth. It has a feeling to it that I've not felt before on a razor. Very comfortable. So we'll see how it does with pickup time, shall we? You ready? Three, two, one, pickup time, baby. A couple of people uh, said, was it last weekend? Just gone. I was saying that it's um, on my other channel, I think it was. It could have been. Or oh, was it under this channel? Any anyway, one of them. Saying that it was the um, Thanksgiving on Thursday in. Uh, 
tomorrow in the state and that's right he asked me you know do we do a similar meal here well from what i can make out you have turkey and uh, some people have you know chicken wings and like a bit of a spread as we call it a bit of a buffet um or a you know big meal turkey dinner now we have a turkey dinner here christmas day uh, that's our sort of big meal um and then in the afternoon probably with sandwiches chicken wings ribs whatever you have you know just different salads cheeses plenty of drink <laughs> But um, that would be our version of it, I expect. But, uh, yeah, so fantastic. Here we go, pickup time. No overhang, remember, to be aware of or to worry about. This year is good. Let me just try that. Yeah, lovely. Very precise. The angle on this is slightly different for me than a, a, a normal mild razor because usually it's it was like that, but it wasn't doing nothing, and then you just tilt it that way a bit till you feel it biting. And that was the of course you can change the blade. Be interested now to try their blades in this. But I may do that in a future video using the short handle, you know. That's lovely. That's nice. Right, cold water in, shall we? Oh. There we go. And I just felt that water go down my chest. <laughs> oh. oh, that's lovely. I'll show you how we look now. So that's it with nothing all shaved. Very close. I did have a little thing here, but couldn't be much. Uh, so that's that. Witch Hazel. I'm using the eucalyptus again. Because I want to use it up. No other reason. Oh, it's a lovely scent. Well, I like it. That is nice. If you're having a shave, I hope you have a good one. Of course, let me know, shave of the day. That'd be nice. We don't want the aftershave, do we? Excuse me. There we go. So what are we going to use? I think a good match for this is this uh, aftershave from Forest Fresh from Superdrug. Yeah, it's a nice... Because um... this soap, when you first smell it out of the tin... Oh, that's nice. That is a good match. Well done, Paul. No problem, baby. <laughs> your mileage may vary, of course, your taste, but... Uh... It's a very sort of almost cologne-y sort of soapy, fresh, clean scent. If that, if you can understand what I mean. Nice. And then we use some of this Gabri uh, aftershave uh, cream cologne. Good stuff. Don't need a lot. And we're good to go. Oh, it's lovely. Hope you're in good health. By the way. Right, I'll put any sort of links.
to this razor to their website you can read up on it you can see the dimensions of everything uh, they go into good detail about the razor um, and the brushes on there so i'll put a link to that whatever i use today i try to put i certainly list it underneath and if i've got any links i can put in the it's next to the item if that's any help to anybody so we've used the pearl k2 razor three-piece razor and in the pack comes the long handle and a short handle as i've shown you before so you've got a choice of two and one head obviously um good weight good grip works well it's a mild razor for me with that blade be interesting to try it with a feather or with their own uh, that was the king c gillette second use um you could hear the blade, you could feel it, it hugs the skin, it's very close. Um, quite a precise little razor really, If how it felt for me. Cut really well. Um, so I, I like that, really nice. I'll try it with a short handle probably the next time I use it. This is the, I just, this is the handle for you to see it. This is the White Star, the Pearl White Star uh, synthetic brush and the American flag which is very fitting, I thought, for, for tomorrow. And uh, the synthetic knot, 24 and a half, don't forget the half, uh, millimetre knot synthetic. Really good backbone, feels nice and soft and it worked well on the hard pack. We used the Captain's Choice soap locker. Did its job, I stuck some soap in there, pressed it in and it didn't budge. Lathered up beautifully, still a bit of lather there. Um, and then we've used the Welsh water to rinse. Thank you, Paul. And then we've used some eucalyptus witch hazel, which is homemade, some forest fresh aftershave lotion from Superdrug. We've used this, of course, don't forget the soap. It's a lovely design. And this is called the Sunrise Bliss. Um, I like the scent. That type of scent is lovely for me. Like I say, the fresh, clean, cologne uh, soapy scent. It's a hard soap, as I say. Um, they tell you to bloom it with a few drops of water. I took some out in my bowl, bloomed it there, and I used it as a pre-shave off camera. I didn't show you that because um, I didn't want to waste it, and I had the camera down here, you know. And then uh, after all that, we've used the Gabri. This is the um, aftershave cream cologne uh, lotion, so that's fantastic. Really, really happy with that. Very nice. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a great rest of the week and some shaves if you haven't any. Stay happy if you can, very important. And uh, have a laugh about anything. And then um, stay safe and I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave. So all the best. Happy Thanksgiving for tomorrow to the States. And uh, yeah, see you in the next one. Bye-bye.